My presentation today is about HCV epidemiology and prevention in China. Um, some of the data in this presentation we collected it from the uh, Chinese government and the Heilongjiang province, and some from the reviews of medical lit literature. This, pres this presentation will cover overview of HCV epidemiology in China, introduction to Chinese clinical HCV diagnosis and treatment standards, HCV strategies and challenges in China. Uh, this research was carried out by Ministry of Health amongst uh, in general populations in 31 provinces in China. Actually, MOH is uh, Ministry of Health is uh, very similar to NHS UK. So below is some key points about re this research. Yeah, you can. You can see that data is uh, uh, the number of the presentation was tested 67,153 uh, uh, population in China amongst the 31 provinces and regions in China as the trans and the infection rate is 6.2 percent. This is China map. Actually, sorry, I don't translate to Chinese, so I just try to point. The red area, the infection rate is over 3%. It's, yeah, 14 provinces. And the yellow area is uh, infection rate is 2 to 3%. The blue one is uh, less to 2%. Actually, the total result is show us uh, north of China, the infection rate is higher than south of China. The prevalence of antibody HCV by gender and age in Beijing, you all know Beijing is the capital of China. So this slide shows us that uh, uh, there is no different infection rate between men and women, but as a, as a person got older, that infection rate increased. Regional description of HCV may genotypes in China, 2B and 1A, right? It's, it's most common in China. And recently we found type C, type 6 in Hong Kong and Macau. Um, this is targeted uh, drug users in China. This research was uh, carry, carried out uh, in amongst the different province in different time by different persons. All this data, uh, actually in 2008, all this data was collected by Dr. Yu. After analysis, analysis they found the, all, all this data, they found the infection rate among UI drug users is 61.4% uh, amongst uh, drug in injection drug users in China. Co-infection of HCV, HPV, and HCV, HIV co-infection amongst IDUs. Actually, you all can see about HCV, HIV co-infection, the highest rate is 23.3%. And H HCV, HPV, the highest is, is reach 24.8%. Uh, the target group investigation um, was started in 2008. 31 provinces and uh, regions would, would be covered, and our target groups is uh, injection drug users, STI, clients and men who has sex with men, and the female sex workers and the people living with HIV AIDS. This purpose is we wonder HCV infection rates and HCV and HIV co-infection rates amongst the target groups. So all this data collected depends on the HIV surveillance sites and other resources. But unfortunately, this result 
We didn't know that now, but I think the garment will be published in the near future. Actually, doc, Dr. Zhao Dunhui is from the Heilongjiang province, so we have several slides to show his own province data from re this research. Mm, in 2008, actually, Heilongjiang province spent three months to do this research. They would carry the 1,353 cases in four cities in Heilongjiang province. Their sam sampling method was RDS and snowball rolling. HCV antibody screening is the Shanghai's third generation HCV kit, ELISA. This is uh, case histories in Heilongjiang province. The age medium is 26. 78.2% were married, and 60.6% .6 of them were gay men, and 32.7% were bisexual, and 3.3% heterosexual. This man found their partners mainly from internet, gay bars, bus, bus, bus house, park, parks, and public laboratories. These slides show us about uh, sexual behavior amongst MSM there. So their first, for, first mode of sexual intercourse is uh, 20. And during the past six months, 83.8% who has annual intercourse with men, the no protection rate is 55.4%. 6.5% had sex for commercial purpose, actually we call MB, money boy. And 44.7% of money boys have an annual intercourse, didn't use a condom. 56.7% have more than two partners. During the past six months, 22.1% have had sex with a woman. 60.2% of these didn't use a condom. During the past six months, 0.9% have taken drugs. Half of them have ejected. 50.1% of the samples had the symptom of sexual disease during the past one year. HIV syphilis and HCV infection amongst MSM you can see the HCV, actually this is the four cities in Heilongjiang province. You can see the total HCV transmitted rate, rate is 0.5%, but highest is 0.9% in Harbin. Harbin is the capital in Heilongjiang province. And the syphilis rate is very high. You can see that highest is 24.5%. HCV infection in other, H, HCV infection in female sex workers and people living with HIV AIDS. 6,052 female sex workers in 65 cities and towns in Heilongjiang province, the highest city HCV infection rate is 1.5%. The average is 0.5%. Of 52 people, I live with HIV through sex. 20% have abnormal liver function, but their HCV status is as yet unknown. The original result of this, you know, this uh, investigation, sexual transmission rate is very low. MSM have no higher risk than heterosexual, both MSM and F SW transmit rate 0.5%. But sexual transmission of HCV cannot be overlooked because the number of the population is huge. And the condom user rate is very low. And the STI infection rate is very high. So it indicates that the infection rate amongst the general public in China may be dropping, but it's not clear yet. <laughs> 